important to think about this at trick one, not part way through the hand, okay? So let's go back and do that again. It's called planning ahead. Now, shh, 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 shh. ace of hearts, three of hearts, two of hearts, five of hearts, because you don't wish hearts continued. This Even is though a, you have the queen, you have a two other spade friends. contract. You see, shh, shh, shh. when they're in two spades, in order to beat that contract, you've got to take a whole mess of tricks. Not just five, but six. There are too many of us that when we play, we think, oh, they're bidding again. I never get enough cards. I want to play this hand. Defense is the most exciting part of the game. It's the stuff that builds chemistry across the table with your partner. Relationships are built on this. They're also destroyed. So be careful, okay? So you've got to do this. You've got to watch, because your job as a defender is to hurt, maim, and destroy. Barbara! <laughs> you want to beat them. You want to take six tricks, not just five, but six, okay? And that will teach them respect so that they will tremble when you come to their table. <laughs> All right. And by the way, the, the hurt, maim, and destroy thing, it's always done with a smile on your face and always with love in your heart. Right. So now, no more hearts. Wes says, don't need another heart. Now up to Wes to figure out, well then, what on earth should I lead? We can't lead hearts, and we're not leading trumps. That leaves clubs or diamonds. Now look at West's hand. West has the jack of clubs. So if partner was going to have anything in clubs, it might be the ace of clubs, but that's all because West has the jack. So how many tricks would that be? Only one. Does that beat this contract? No. So therefore you pick the other suit that has more potential that partner might have more stuff than just one trick. And that leaves you with the fourth leftover suit, diamonds. So seven of diamonds, top of nothing. Let's say declarer calls for the nine of diamonds from the north hand. East will win it with the ten, and south will play the two. Turn those over. Now, you want to get partner back on lead to do that again one more time with feeling, right? With feeling. So nine of hearts, ten of hearts, jack of hearts, six of hearts. Now West, West knows that East must have the ace and queen of diamonds because the lowly ten won a trick. So now West leads the six of diamonds, jack of diamonds, Queen of diamonds, three of diamonds. And now, East is going to cash the ace of diamonds, eating dummies king, diamond, diamond, diamond. And now, East is going to cash her high queen of hearts, queen of hearts, heart, heart, heart. West, do not overtake with the king of hearts unless you know why you are doing that and what you wish to do next, then you know. <laughs> <laughs> My I'm not angry, really. I just want you to remember. <laughs> East. East. Now, when all looks lost, we seldom ever lead suits that dummy doesn't have any of. But when all looks as though there's no hope of taking any more tricks, you know, remember, remember, all the other suits have been played. Declare has to have the ace of clubs or she couldn't have opened the bidding if she just had a bunch of spades, ace, king, queen, jack. Not enough points for an opening bid. So when the dummy has cruddy trumps, okay, or crummy dummy, okay, then lead the 13th card, okay, in your suit and give Declare the slap rub, all right, in hopes that partner's got some magic card in trumps. So can you see now that if East leads the Age of Diamonds, if South trumps, if South trumps with the five of spades, West over trumps with the jack. If, if 
Sal Trump's with the Queen of Spades. Let's have her Trump with the Queen of Spades. Wes, don't under Trump, for God's sake. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, with eight of clubs from the dummy. Okay, turn those over. <coughs> now look what happens. Poor, poor declarer. Ace of spades. Let's do it so that everybody sees it. Ace of spades, spade, spade, spade. King of spades, spade, spade. Whatever. And now can you see that Wes Jack of spades has now matured or grown up or been promoted into a trick. Does that make sense? Down two. And that will teach them respect. Okay, sort them back into... Okay. What do you think, Barbara? Mm -hmm. It was almost like she could read right through the pack. In fact, have any of you read that book, Reading Through the Pack? Yeah. I actually have some glasses that um, I sell. These are see-through glasses. And um, I think, don't one of, um, I have somebody out here who has some of my see-through glasses that they purchased from me. Carol, Carol has, okay. Well, I have two hands. One is going to be with queen third, the other is three little. You got them on, Carol? No. Okay. I got them on. Okay, which oh, hand has the queen? Wow. Oh, the hand, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah. The right hand. <laughs> oh. You're enough, there's the queen. Good job, Carol. Uh, can I practice with these a little bit? <laughs> yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Um, can all the men stand up, please? <laughs> I'm saying behind the podium. <laughs> no, Carol, through the pack only, please. Is, is, I'm sorry. Is there a director in the house? Could <laughs> be <laughs> <Pretty> short. <laughs> Touche. Uh, that was a little bit of improv. I had no idea what she was going to do, I swear. <laughs> I'll share my patents with you on the royalties. Good job. Okay, so we want to think emotion. And Barbara did a wonderful job. And Carol, thank you on emotion. We want to go with the force like Luke Skywalker did. We want to be positive. We want to try harder. We want to share that power with our students to be fun and to be authentic. Because the students will know when we're not authentic. If we're not honest and genuine, what happens is eventually, you know what happens? The tide goes out in the ocean. And if you forgot your swimsuit, everybody's going to know. So be real. Okay, so emotional involvement, it requires us to be playful. We need heroes. We want to be animated. And we want to build a rapport with our students. But about every 30 seconds, we want to change something. It can be where we change our pace, our rhythm, our content, our mood. Those are some of the things we think about when we make it where it's where the students feel like they own something. And we don't want to be the heroes. We want them to be the heroes, right? We want to share the power. It was Spider-Man who said, with great power comes great responsibility. Or as Shakespeare said, heavy is the head that wears the crown. Would you believe that George Bush, 41, actually quoted Spider-Man and said, with great power comes great responsibility? So share that with your classmates. He actually did. I thought, wow, that's great.